Gluons mediate the strong force. They have no mass, no electric charge, and no weak charge. So depicting gluons visually is a real challenge. To begin with, there are eight of them, and each carries a combination of color charge. Secondly, there are no free gluons. They exist only virtually when two quarks interact. Third, since gluons have their own color charge, they generate secondary virtual gluons. These generate other gluons ad infinitum. This means there's such an ongoing storm of these gluons that the whole process is impossibly complicated. But undaunted, we press on. We know that when gluons cause two quarks to interact, the quarks swap color. And since color is conserved, the gluon must have at least two colors of its own. Next, we know that the strong force mediated by the gluons increases the strength as the quarks get further apart. This means the gluon field is what is called a flux tube, and this leads to a gluon shaped like a string. Putting all these ideas together leads to the depiction you see on the screen.